Hey guys, what's up? Uh, welcome back, or if you're new here, hi, my name is Melissa. I am uh, a YouTube blogger. I vlog about my uh, weight loss surgery and my life, school, and kind of everything in between. So um, I'm actually starting off this vlog, or this clip I should say, um, in my community college that I'm going to. Um, I'm actually, I came here, it's Friday, and classes start on Tuesday, and so I came here because um, I always do this with like, whenever I go to a new school, I map out exactly where my classes are, I do like a practice run to kind of figure out like where everything is, especially if it's a new school. After a while, um, you kind of figure out where everything is and where what buildings are where and all that stuff, but um, since I've never been here before, <laughs> um, I decided I was going to map this out. It is Friday, almost 6 o'clock, um, and yeah, I'm just really excited. Um, unfortunately, all the classrooms are locked, but I did find the two classrooms that I'm going to be heading into, or will be taking my biology course at least. Um, so. This is kind of what the inside looks like. Like I said, the doors are locked, so you can't really see, but it's a typical science-y biology lab. And then we have a couple, looks like maybe that's an office or a classroom. Looks like this is another um, like biology, chemistry kind of deal. I don't know what these are or why they're around. Oh, they're lab coats. That's actually what it says on the thing right there. So they're lab coats. Um, and then in here is the, uh, like, hall, lecture hall, I guess. So I'm assuming um, this is where my lecture portion of this, the class is going to be. And then this is where my, because um, it's the exact same room, this is where my lab will be. So, yeah, um, that's pretty exciting. Um, I thought I was going to maybe go check out the nursing building again, but... Um, I don't need to actually know where my class is on that one because I already know where the annex building is, but um, maybe I'll go take you guys over there just real quick just since like literally nobody's here. Like I walked in the door and I think I saw one other person. So it's, you know, Friday, it's almost six o'clock. There's nobody here. Like even the welcome desk was shut down. So um, I guess I will take you guys over there because there's nobody here and it's a good opportunity. All right, so let's go.
Alright guys, so this is the annex building. So this is the nursing building that's here. This is where I will be taking all of my CNA classes and any nursing related classes I'll have. Um, that clip or that little uh, picture that I showed you is actually um, uh, graduations of people who went to the nursing program here and they're all along the wall. The oldest one that I found was actually May of 1992, so it was like two more two months before <laughs> I was even born, which is really cool. And uh, yeah, it goes from like 92 all the way up until recent. So yeah, um, that's pretty much the whole building. Um, it's actually pretty small um, considering that you know, there's a lot of people that are in the nursing program, but um, I kind of like that. I think that's why, for me, personally, choosing a community college to go to was always a better option because um, I do really, I do a lot better in, like, close-knit kind of classroom settings as opposed to, like, bigger universities or, like, huge lecture halls and things like that. I don't think I could personally ever do that. Um, and just because... I feel like I would get so lost and so confused and I wouldn't know who to ask for help or anything like that. So I'm really grateful that um, this particular community college that I'm going to um, offers the associate's degree and also offers the BSN, uh, which is the Bachelor's of Science of Nursing. So I can actually do all four years and everything here at the community college instead of having to transfer out to university. Um, also, it comes at a lower cost to us, obviously, because we're not going to, you know, like CSU or UC Denver or something like that. So um, that's always really nice too. But yeah, I'm really excited to be here and um, it's... <laughs> It's almost kind of eerily quiet in here because there's like literally nobody here. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited. I'm probably going to head out of here. I was maybe planning on trying to go to my sister's tonight, but honestly, it's already almost 6. By the time I get over there, it's going to be like 7.30 because um, I'm like an hour and a half away. So I might just not go today. I might just try and see her next week. So we'll kind of see. We'll play it out. But yeah, I'll probably, if anything, I may just go to the store and then go home because um, I have a couple things I needed to get from the store. And then, um, yeah, I might just head home. So uh, thank you for um, hanging out with me and um, taking a, a little mini tour of around the college. Um, I'm really excited to start classes next week, so they'll start Tuesday, and yeah, um, I haven't really decided if I'm gonna, like, add this as part of the vlog for next week, or if I'm just gonna, like, make it into, like, a little mini video. It's already at, like, 10 minutes or over 10 minutes, so I might just make it into a little mini video, um, of just me walking around the college and, like, you know showing you guys what I'm going to be doing. Well, not what I'm going to be doing, but I guess where I'm going to be doing it. So, all right, I'm going to head back to my car. It's really hot today, by the way. I don't know why. It's like not hot, like with the sun out, like the sun's not out. It's all super cloudy um, because it's going to rain in a couple days. So it's like that summer heat plus rain combo. So, Anyway, um, yep, alright, I will probably see you guys on Tuesday. Bye. Hey guys, alright, cool, so I'm back. Um, so yeah, this is the watch, um, comes in this cute little nifty package. Um, apparently it's by, uh, somebody called Dakota, or the company's name is Dakota. Um, and let me show you what it looks like. So, um, there's this little, oh, apparently this is about the batch, uh, batch, battery watch. Um, oh, and they give you some coupons for when you need to change your battery. So that's cool. Um, this, I believe, is an instructions, potentially, on how to use it, but it's, like, folded really weird. Yeah, 
so it's instructions on how to use it and probably how to set it and then we have this little thingy in there um it's a cnc service center warranty oh okay so it looks like it comes with a warranty so that's cool and then yeah so this is what the watch looks like um it's all pink and it's got like this um, rubbery, plasticky kind of uh, wristband. Uh, so that's really cool. I really like that. I actually had a similar wristband uh, when I bought my iWatch, but then I bought this cute little like puppy dog uh, band instead. So, um, but that originally my iWatch came with a similar kind of um, band. So yeah. I'm pretty excited. Um, I got this one because it lights up apparently and also um, it's big enough <laughs> that I can see it um, because I again I have glasses and I have cataracts so I need to be able to uh, see the watch. Uh, so yeah so pretty happy with this. Um, kind of just practice put it on my arm. Oh yeah I can definitely see the watch. So. Um, Alright, so that should be the end now, officially. Um, I do have uh, one more thing coming in. I have my scrub tops coming in. Um, they should be here, I think, by the second. So they're not going to be here for a few more days. But um, I'll show you those when I get those. Um, they're just a pretty generic, um, plain grape uh, Cherokee brand specifically because um, they were saying that um, as CNA students that if we're planning on going into the nursing program or you know even if we're not um, that it might be recommended to get the Cherokee brand um, because the nursing students um, are required to wear the Cherokee brand scrub tops. Um, they didn't really specify on bottoms so I don't know if you also have to have like purple bottoms. Um, for us, for CNA people, um, they said that any black scrub bottoms would be fine. Um, and then, but we needed to have, you know, the purple scrub tops. And um, for CNA, you can technically get any brand that you want. Um, but like I said, they recommend that you get the Cherokee brand if you're planning or thinking about going to nursing school. So I went ahead and I got the Cherokee brand. And let me tell you, those things are not cheap. Like, I paid, I think it was like $21 or $24.99 or something for per top. So it was like almost, I think it was $50. I think it might have been over $50, um, like $50, $55, somewhere in there, to get like two tops. Two. That's all I got. And I, I had to drop $50 on that. So that was kind of rough. Um, I don't know if it's just... I've been shopping for scrubs um, at Uniform Advantage. Um, they're an online scrub store. And they just mail everything directly to you. Um, for some reason, I haven't had a lot of luck um, going in-store to like scrub shops. We have quite a few of them around here because I live in Denver. So we're just... A big city we have you know all those you know a bunch of shopping centers and things like that and I've been to a, a few of them and um, I never find exactly what it is I'm looking for either they don't have my size they don't have the color or they don't have the brand and so um, I knew that this time around when I needed to order scrubs I was like I don't want to drive around to five different places I just want to be able to buy it online have it shipped to me and have it be exactly what I'm looking for so that's what I did this time around, but I'm kind of curious to see, like, if it would be any cheaper if I would have bought it in store. I don't really know, but I feel like that's pretty average for scrub prices. Like, when I bought my scrub pants, I think I spent, whew, because I bought, like, four of them, I think, and it was, like, $200. I think I spent, like, 230 or something. I also bought, like, a little pen light, but... Yeah, it was pretty expensive, and those pants that I bought were, like, I think, like, $40 a pop, so I think, yeah, so, you know, 40 times 4, that's, you know, I think, <laughs> I can't do math, um, yeah, I, I don't know, it, it was just, it was a ridiculous amount of money, but, um, 
I, you know, I, I needed them at the time for the job and I didn't have any scrubs that I really liked because I always would buy scrubs at like Walmart or something and I'd buy the cheapest thing possible and I hated the way that they felt. They didn't fit right. They were really scratchy and itchy. So this time around when I was like, okay, I have a really good job, had a really good job and, um, I wanted something that was going to fit well and that I was going to be comfortable in for 12 hours. So I re am really glad that I bought those, um, they're joggers, so they're all black joggers. Um, I'm really glad I did buy those um, when I had the money because now I can use them for CNA and hopefully we'll be able to use them for nursing school. Um, that's really dependent on one, if I go to nursing school and two, where I'm at as far as my weight goes because that's kind of the other thing is like, I'm still in the process of losing weight and so I very well, a year from now, may not be the same size that I am today. At least that's what I'm hoping for, fingers crossed. So um, it's very well possible that I may have to, you know, spend more money again to buy more scrubs. But um, for right now, they work and I'm just, yeah, I'm just blabbing about stuff now. But I'm really excited overall. Um, I start classes officially on Tuesday. So yeah. Um, thank you guys for hanging out with me as always and uh, make sure you like and subscribe to these videos because I'm definitely going to do more of them, especially now that I have things going on in my life that are somewhat positive. Um, so yeah, um, take care. Uh, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next week. Bye. What's up? I'm back home. Um, I was going to end the vlog and then I forgot that I picked up um, a package today from Amazon. So. As part of my um, uniform requirements for CNA, and honestly this probably will apply to a lot of nursing students too, um, we, our school required that we had a watch with a second hand on it. Um, we're not allowed to use our smart watches. We can wear them <laughs> um, like with our watch, but um, we have to have a watch with a second hand. So um, uh, they didn't specify like if it needed to be black or white or if it needed to match or whatever. So I went and I got um, a little pink second hand watch. Um, it was $37 I think on Amazon which honestly I don't know if that's like expensive or cheap I felt like it was kind of expensive because I feel like these watches are you like should be like really cheap especially with um smart watches out now but whatever um so let me oh shoot my battery is gonna die okay let me change my battery really quick and I'll be right back